Oh, out on the road again. Let's get a move on. Welcome back, everybody. We're about to play Pokemon Blue. This is your host, MJ406. And well, now we have Oak's parcel. I think it's about time we go give it back to him. Our Pokemon journey is about to, well, continue once more. I just gotta make sure I get home safely. God damn it! All right, I better go over something right now I'm gonna do. It's a Pidgey. Here's some info for you. Not much info to go on. Yep, Brio's just gonna tell you what Pokemon it is. Brio's gonna tell you where to find it. That's basically it. And it's types, I guess. I need to get you out of my way. Take this, Leech Seed! I love this move. I mean, Pidgey was seeded. This way Leech Seed works is pretty cool. It'll sap the Life Force out of a Pokemon and give it to me. So it's a very weak Pokemon right now, it won't really mean much, but... Later on, this move will... Ow! Be useful. See, so yeah, every time we encounter a new Pokemon in the wild, at least base form... I'll go over that in a bit. I mean, go out of that eventually. Oh, god damn it! Damn you, 95 accuracy! Ow! After a while, uh... Yeah, I'll go over the base Pokemon you'll see, and, uh... Where you can find it! Which, yeah, if you see locations like route something or in a certain town, that's basically what it is. Or a cave. So... Yeah. That's basically how I'll go over every single new Pokemon we run into. It's base form. I'll go over what I mean by that later on, in case you don't know. Anyway, let's go deliver Oak's parcel. Damn Pidgey getting in my way. I'll go over the first location you find it. I'll say that. The first or best location to find it, whatever. Oh, dumbass! How's my old Pokemon? Well, it seems you to like you a lot. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. What? You have something for me? Dumbass delivered Oak's parcel. About goddamn time. Ah, this is the custom Pokeball I ordered. Thank you, custom Pokeball. Gramps! Oh, now what do you want? What did you call me for? Oh, right, I have a request of you two. On the desk there is my invention, Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Dumbass and Dumbrass, take these with you. The Pokedex. This will help us give us some Pokemon information. To make, to make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world? That was my dream. But I'm too old. I can't do it. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. All right, Gramps. Leave it all to me. Dumbass, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. I know, I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one, dumbass. <laughs> Yo, screw you, dude. I hate Dumbass. He was always worse than me, I thought. I'll go out around the world wait for you, dumbass. Uh, thank you. Well, I'm off. See you guys. I better get out of here. Technology is incredible. If you're not sure, recall items as Pokemon as data via PC. I hope that's all you can recall, not something else. Do I be worried otherwise? Well, I better get myself a town map. Grandpa asked you to run an errand? Here, this will help you. Yay! You're the best, Dumbrass's sister. Ah. Make sure you pick this up. You'll want this. Twilight Pokedex. Oh, yeah. Right, I forgot about that. If you hit area, they'll actually tell you where to... So I don't even need to do that! See, look at that! Good, I don't even need to put that down at all. So I just said something for nothing. So yep, you go to do your Pokedex, go to a Pokemon you see in it, hit area, you can see all the places that you'd find that Pokemon. So yeah, some useful information for you. And you also get some base data, on the, you can at least remember what the Pokemon is visually by looking at it. And also hear out sounds. So good, I don't even need to do that! As long as you can see where it is, I will tell you if it's a version exclusive Pokemon. Or if it's another kind of condition. Either way, good, I barely don't re I don't really have to enter information. Dumbass, you should take a quick rest! Thank you, Mommy. Thank you very much, Mommy. Oh good, you and your Pokemon are looking great, take care now! I already rested! Stop making me sleep at home! Are you child sick? Damn! Come on, lady, I got an adventure to go on! Me and my pets are gonna dominate everybody out there! I mean, explore the world of wonders. 
Let's get moving. Now I can keep track of all the Pokemon I've seen. I want to hope at least I can get all the main uh, Pokemon in there. Seen. Not owned at least, but at least seen. So there's 150 I gotta track down. Ha ha ha! Now who's in my way? You bastard! Get out of my way! Ooh, level 4. That means you're worth fighting. I got a hell out of my way! Ah, oh, crap. Oh, God! No, 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 I shouldn't risk this. You know what? I'll beat the hell out of here. Got away safely. So yeah, you can run away from a Pokemon. But keep in mind, if the Pokemon's fast, your chances of running away are certainly less. So make sure that Pokemon's not too fast, or else you're gonna have to fight your way out. That's why you gotta make sure your Pokemon are at least pretty good level. That's why grinding may be necessary at times. What are you doing here? I go shop in Peter City. I have to take the winding trail in Viridian Forest. That makes sense. Hello, old man. Ah, I've had my coffee and now I feel great. Sure you can go through. Are you in a hurry? Uh, maybe? Time is money. Go along then. Time is money. What the hell is this? Dumbass about potion. Why is he just lying in a bush? Oh no. What do you mean I was in a, if I was in a hurry? Viridian City Pokemon Gym. Oh. This Pokemon Gym is always closed. I wonder who the leader is. Yeah. You know, that is a good point. I have wondered that. So now you're feeling good. Are you in a hurry? Not really, I guess. I see you're using a Pokedex. When you catch a Pokemon, Pokedex is automatically updated. What? Don't you know how to catch Pokemon? How do you know about the Pokedex anyway? I thought it was a new invention he had. What the hell is this? I'll show you how to then. Oh god, we're fighting! No, we're not. What the hell is that? It's a Weedle. Oh shit. So, this is your tutorial on how to catch Pokemon. If you have Pokeballs, hold man, use Pokeball. You can throw it at a Pokemon, and uh, well, all right, we know what's caught. And well, in three shakes, if it doesn't break out, you caught it. But it can break out. First, you need to weaken the target Pokemon. Yes, thank you for that. Trainer tips: catch Pokemon, expand your collection. The more you have, the easier it is to fight. It's good to know. Speaking of which, I don't think I have any Pokeballs, so I should probably go buy some of the Pokemart. I don't need potions, so I'm not really worried about, you know, keeping them healthy. I'm usually, I usually do a good job with that. I'm back. I know, may I help you? So, yep, you can buy yourself some heals for certain status conditions, but I just want Pokeballs. Oh, jeez, I can't even buy that many. Give me all that I can get my hands on. I like having a lot of Pokeballs on me. Because catching Pokemon is essential. Trust me, it is. Hmm, I could go for. I want to go. I like to go this way. So it's finally time for us to catch some Pokemon. I should be careful though, because I know something's lying around here. Oh yeah, this is the way to the uh, Pokemon League, I believe. Where can I go to check the map anyway? I'm trying to remember. Oh, okay. Go to items. Use town map. You press up or down, basically, see where all locations are. Pallet Town, Route 1, Viridian City, Route 2, Viridian Forest, Tickets Cave, Peter City. Then you can see all the locations here. Sea Cottage, Viridian City, SSN. So, yeah, you can basically see where everything is in this game. A lot of routes, a lot of other cities. Basically, telling the order to go through them in. Route 22, 23, Victory Road, and Indigo Plateau. The Indigo Plateau is where you will meet the uh, Elite Four. So they are this way. I'm gonna go battle them now! <laughs> no. No. I only came here to catch a particular Pokemon. I know which one I want. So let's go digging around for it. I really want to catch Pokemon on recording, so... Yeah. Ratata! Oh, level two! And here you are wasting my time. Oh, God damn it! Are you really gonna keep messing? Fine, get away from that thing. <laughs> Oh, well, that was quick. Oh, so you're gonna hunt me down, are you? Bulbasaur? Don't even bother with him. He's a jealous type. He's just gonna keep bugging you with that kind of crap. Really, don't worry about him. He's a loser anyway. Stupid Ratatan is goddamn weird, loop weird, bent fangs. Your hair fangs are kind of messed up. That's what I want. Need a ran female. 
One of the only Pokemon in this game to have a gender. Gender sets are becoming normal tool gen too. Go dirt no half ah Hmm I wanna try to get something higher level. Oh right, you growled at me. I was gonna say, why is my attack doing less? It's growling at me! Besides, if you only know growl, I really don't want you on my team. It is worth defeating most Pokemon you can find, though. I just want to catch a Nidoran female that's good, and I'll leave. Although, catching one of you... Oh, there we go, level 4. Alright. Catching a whole bunch of Pokemon is essential. You want a full team with you to be able to fight off a lot of these bastards. Yeah, okay, gotta remember, weaken them first, and then attempt to catch them. I, for one, once they go below half, I feel like I'm good. Here's the Pokeball, and catch! And... I got it! Right as I was caught! Yay! I got a new Pokemon now. Pokedex data will be added. Once you catch a Pokemon, you can full data on it. It's Rattata, the rat Pokemon. Bites anything when it attacks. Small and very quick. It is a common sight in many places. No crap. I don't care about nicknames for them. I'm a jerk that doesn't like to name every individual Pokemon they get based on personality. I'm just a dick that way. Alright, who's next? God damn you! <laughs> there are so many of them! Oh yeah, I also noticed you don't get experience points for catching a Pokemon. You only get experience if you defeat it. That was a critical hit? Jeez. Ow. It did the same amount of damage! Oh, by the way, critical hit. I think it is, like a 1 in 8 chance you get it. Yes! Level 8. Oh, forgot to go over the stat increases. Crap. I guess I should check that. I don't really care much about the stats that go up as the Pokemon levels up. I'm just gonna keep finding these things, aren't I? Get away from me! Ugh. Ah! Hmm. Oh, I did remember a stat was gonna go over. Oh, there we go, level 4. That's what I want. Okay. I don't think I should leech seed it, because I might accidentally kill it that way. Ow, there you go, now you don't move. I want this Pokemon at least for now, because... Ow! It has... It might have useful moves in the future. Oh, no! Oh, no! Actually, thank you for that. I don't want to kill you. Stop missing! It's 90%, not 95%, not freaking 80! No! Bulbasaur! I'm not doing Nuzlocke, so you can stay alive. Alright, Ratata. Oh, God, your sprite looks horrible. Let's go over... Oh, yeah, I may as well go over this. The Pokemon Blue and Red version we've gotten in the Americas and internationally... Got it. The Pokemon Blue and Red version we got internationally... Well, it's basically an updated version of what Red and... What Red and Green originally were for Japan back in 95. They eventually got an updated blue version, which is basically what this is. They updated sprites to be less offensive and improved a few mechanics, a little bit, but it's still basically the same game. No need to ran female, a poison pit Pokemon. Although small, its venomous barb renders this Pokemon dangerous. The female has smaller horns. There's a male as well, but I think, pretty sure that's red ex Actually, no, I don't think it is. I don't want to give a nickname, I just wanted to have it. Actually, the male version might be exclusive to, uh, Red. Oh, yeah! That's all I have to look up. I better get that on my phone at some point. Which, thanks to a game like this, it's very easy for you to multitask. So I can look up stuff up on my phone while I play. But first, let me heal my Pokémon. Now, heal it, bitch! Including the ones I just caught. And now I have this. Beautiful team I'm building. Whoops. Jumped a little too high. Okay. Yeah, I got a list of the exclusive Pokemon, or at least I'm trying to. Game exclusives. Let's see. No, the Nidorans aren't exclusive. In case you're wondering why there's a female Nidoran, there's a male one as well. And I can tell you this much. I'd rather have the male, but if I can only get the female, that's fine. It might just be hard to find in a different area. Still, I want my team to be strong. Get out of my way! 
By the way, in case you're wondering a good way to train weak Pokemon, try it. You can have do it one of two ways. Either get your strong Pokemon weak at a Pokemon, and have one of your weaker ones finish it. Or the other way around. The other way around is to Oh god damn, I used Growl instead. The other way around is basically to have your weak Pokemon come out, and then immediately switch to your strong Pokemon. As long as they take part in the battle, they should get the easy experience. They'll get like, it like splits in half if you have two Pokemon out there, splits into three if you have, you know, it splits across the board over how many Pokemon are in the battle, so. Don't try to get everybody involved or it'll take forever to level them up. You gotta take your time, but use your strongest Pokemon, typically your starter, in order to raise the level of your weaker ones. You're better off that way. Ow. Get out of my way, you frickin' Nina Rand, bitch! And see, here we go. They all got ten. Hmm. Wow, this place looks nice. Why am I running into a wall constantly? I don't know. No, I'm gonna go. Why did. What the hell are you here? Hey, dumbass! You're going to Pokemon League? Forget it! You probably don't have any badges! The guard won't let you through! By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Really already, dude? Already? You son of a bitch! Well, here we are, Dumbrass! Dumbrass, it's a fight! Haha! <laughs> oh, but. Wow! I came here too early! Oh, Jesus! Ow! Well, this is bad. This is bad. Leech Seed! Help! Oh, God. This is a bad move. Ah, oh, see an attack! No, my accuracy! Wait, did you just do two attacks? Oh no, no, never mind. It's the next turn. <laughs> I was gonna say! Oh, it's leached every time it attacks, I see. Damn it, no! Stop sand attacking me! I'll absorb all of your energy, you bastard. Oh no! Ow! Give me more of your health. Uh, this move becomes more useful as the Pokemon gets stronger. Alright, I need one of you to cover for me! I'm nearly dead! Ah, oh, I forgot how strong he was! I probably didn't want to come this way yet! Ah, crap! But see, he already caught a Pidgey! That's pretty... strong! Ow! No! Renata! Alright, female Nita ran! Growl at him if you can see him! Leech Seed will work with every Pokemon on your team. You just have to Leech Seed the Pokemon once. As long as the Pokemon stays out, you will keep getting health from it. Why can't you growl at him? Why does he keep using Sand Attack? Stop lowering my accuracy, you asshole! My god! Oh yeah, good job fighting back. Yeah, you do have other stats. Accuracy is another in-battle stat that can go down stages. Go down or up stages. And while basically accuracy, if that goes down, it's harder for you to hit the Pokemon in question. Oh god, you're probably dead. Then again, I am growling at it. So hopefully that'll keep me alive. Growl will lower the attack. There are moves that lower defense. Special stat. As well as, uh... Speed! There's also accuracy and evasion. It's important to note. God damn it, that's painful! Well, and well, critical hits will negate all the friggin' stat changes. Well, Bulbasaur, hurry up and kill it. The only good thing about this is that, well, if I kill it, I'll get all the experience from killing it, but I'll still have to battle if I can't win the fight. So if Bulbasaur gets stronger, but the others are still weak as hell. About to use Charmander. Will I change Pokemon? I can't, because Bulbasaur's all I have left. Well, why is Pidgey stronger than your friggin' Charmander? Do you hate your starter or something? My god! In that case, I'm gonna Leech Seed him. Oh no, I did Leech Seed again by accident. I'm spamming. No! Yeah, he's already evaded because he's already seen it, you dumbass. Ow! If I can lower his attack, and keep growling at him, I can kill him. 
God, that Pidgey was strong! Oh, God. That freaking near-death sound is painful. It really is. Am I really gonna win this fight somehow? Well, I shouldn't be saying that since I'm nearly dead! Ow. If I keep growling to the point, you can only do one attack every time he scratches me. Unless he gets a critical hit, I can keep going. Oh, you son of a bitch. But I am the advantage thanks to Leech Seed. I will make it so your attacks can't do shit. I guess mine are gonna be the same. So, we're having a back in Mexican standoff, are we? I guess that's how this is gonna go. Alright then. Ow. There we go. Unless you get a critical hit, I pretty much got you knocked out now. See, Leech Seed is extremely overpowered. Especially once you get, especially later in the game, and especially due to a glitchy way the move works. I'll just put it this way. You know the, one, you know the status effect poison that can basically hurt a Pokemon over time? If you can poison an enemy Pokemon and Leech Seed it, the damage that gets caused to the Pokemon stacks because of the way poison works. Well, a particular kind of poisoning. That's something that needs to be explained, but that's what a particular move does. Basically, you stack that, you can get even more health out of Leech Seed. So basically, you can heal yourself like crazy and damage Pokemon like crazy. So against the tough Pokemon, it's a very good strategy to use. It's a glitch, but that's beside the point. Also, I cannot believe I won this fight. I was completely, completely unprepared, but... Bulbasaur OP. That Leech Seed will be my saving grace. And I get good experience for that. Take that, dumb brass! I can't believe you didn't beat me! Oh, You just lucked out! I got 280 Poké Dollars. I heard Pokémon League is many tough trainers. I had to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dawdling and get a move on. Why'd you try to battle them already? You probably had your ass whooped. You moron. Oh yeah, I should go heal my Pokémon. God damn. Hmm. Well. Oh no! I'M NOT READY! I don't want to keep battling with frickin' my Bulbasaur the way it is right now. It's not worth battling with Bulbasaur right now. I need to train the others. But I guess I shouldn't worry about training just yet. I don't really have the Pokemon I want for my team. So I shouldn't worry about it just yet. But I do want to heal up. So let me do that. Wow! They got their asses whooped! That was very unfortunate. Well, I got what I wanted. I feel good now. So let me change my lead Pokemon over. Because Bulbasaur is a lot stronger than everybody else I have now. I don't need him to get that much stronger yet. We're going to be going through a whole crazy place. I know Pokemon I want on my team. In fact, before we end this episode, let me go catch such a thing. Which, thankfully, if I just walk around the grass around the edge of town, I can get try to get what I want, and then leave! So let's go find it. Yes! You're the one I want! Level 3, I'll take it! I need to try to use my weaker Pokémon to fight it, in case I accidentally kill it. Good to Oh god, ow! You're not gonna make this easy, are you? I forgot all you know is Gust. Well, you'll be useful, including that move, in the next place we're going, so I'd rather have you. Besides, I really want this Pokemon on my team. I really do. Alright! You're mine! Get in the ball! Slave, get in there! Yeah, that's right! Pidgey was caught! Very caught! That's right! And now we have a new Pokedex, that of her Pidgey! The tiny bird Pokemon! A common sight in forests and woods, it flaps its wings at ground level to kick up binding sand. Want to give a nickname to Pidgey? No. I will keep it on my team, though. Alright, let's go heal up and save. Now, I guess we'll move forward or something. I don't really feel like I need to grind yet. Then again, maybe I should. Oh, damn it. I guess I'll... Should I grind a little bit already? No. I'll just see how it goes as we move forward. I'll try to get Pidgey to be the main fighter for me. That reminds me. 
Ah, I can't even look up the types of moves you have. God damn, this game's old. But you're no. Oh yeah, I should go over all the types of the Pokemon I have. You got normal flying type here, Pidgey. I forgot every Pokemon I fly, you should go over the types of what they are. Nidoran is just a poison type. You don't need to have two types, you can only have one. It's like Charmander only has fire. Rattata here is only normal. The most basic type, clearly. You're actually kind of fast. Bulbasaur is grass and poison, and Pidgey is flying only. Normal and flying, sorry. By the way, it's something I've always been curious about. There's not a single Pokemon that has just flying. Because there's usually some other asset with them, including flying. It's just something I was curious about. You know, I wonder about that sometimes. Well, now Bulbasaur is as strong as he is. I guess training these Pokemon will be easy. So I just have to put them in, bring Bulbasaur out, and then we'll go from there. Well, now it's a good time saying to save. That was fun. And we got Pokemon for my team. But I'm going to get better, hopefully, later on. Hopefully next episode. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, I just saved. I should probably... Ah! God damn it. I right, rather just end here, because if I don't, I'll probably go over there again. All right, come back next time. And we will, um... Well, continue our forward journey into Viridian Forest. And... Yeah. Since I learned we had to get badges to go challenge you to go plateau, I guess we should... Then I should probably check that out, shouldn't I? I'll figure out my plan. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but... I'll figure out something, damn it!